Anytime you do animation, it's really important to kind of plan what you're going to be building. The approval process to getting beginning storyboard phase and animatic phase out of the way is really, really important because then you can really start the work and, and you know exactly what you're building. The direction's very clear. We built thumbnail, mostly storyboard sketches of the character going through the different situations. And then we cleaned those up and created an animatic from that to get a sense of timing and a sense of rhythm and, the, and pacing in the entire project. He had these style frames that he had made with these really cool, kind of dulled down reds and blues and this kind of like that tobacco stain yellow color and kind of give everything like a grungy look to it. We use that color and the contrast of that color against the rest of the backgrounds to pretty much thread the whole thing together. I illustrated all of JJ's sketches for the sets. He had sketches for the bathroom and, and just kind of what we wanted to do. I went into Illustrator, made them all, and set them up in what we call 2.5D. So it's kind of like having cards in space, like little playing cards or something. You get this like fake 3D set that you can move a camera around in a little bit to kind of give the illusion of depth. Rigging is the process where we give a character a skeleton structure and controllers to drive that skeleton. We had to use what's called the puppet tool in After Effects, which generates a mesh around a shape, and then we connect the mesh, or the actual drawing, to those bones in order to animate the character. And so from that, we can get a whole variety of poses and just kind of animate on the fly. These characters kind of turn into digital puppets. You move one hand and it moves the rest of the arm. and It's kind of like we're digital puppeteers. A lot of times I would actually act out some of those motions. I mean, it's, it's not like we had to do crazy performance things, no, but, but the timing is important. And so we still had to like, you know, I, I would walk around or I would time things out or I'd count in my head to see how long a specific action would take. So a lot of times you'll see, you know, JJ or I just kind of walking around being really weird. What are you guys doing? Did you, did, do you think he's odd? Thankfully, his character was grounded pretty much in reality, so I didn't have to do anything too crazy. <laughs> All right. Cheers. Cheers. Another project down. All right, stop. <laughs>